She's Harry the will be reading there from this megaphone. Okay. And her, her, her. I will be working against She's this over. wall. I think a good lady. place awesome. for you guys to be might be like right there kind of in front of the table. Adele Clark, who was um, the uh, head of the uh, Virginia Arts Commission from 1941 to 1964, and she says, I've always tried to combine my interest in art with my interest in government. I think we ought to have more of the creative and imaginative in politics. now and then which depart from the norm. The South is full of eccentric characters. It fosters individuality. <gasps> Richmond's Greenwich Village, artists of the 1920s. Here were six bookstores, two interior design firms, and antique and furniture shops. By art. Ready? Okay. I buy art to match my coat or compliment my yachting boat. The Richmond area, Milk Bottle Baroque. <laughs> Since its construction <laughs> in 1914, the Richmond Dairy Company building at 314, 322 North Jefferson Street in Jackson Ward, the Richmond Dairy Company building was headquarters for a prospering family business. In February 1890, Dairyman J. O. Scott, A. R. Scott, and T. L. Blanton formed the company. Whitlow recalls the constant sound of the dairy's machinery, the rattle of steel roller conveyor belts, the slap of wood and metal tab milk crates, and the clatter of glass bottles. A small restaurant at 312 North Jefferson Street, known as Jack's Sanitary Lunch, and later as the Dairyman's Highway. Served breakfast for the delivery men as their trucks were being loaded. You run out for breakfast, move up your truck, and maybe the five behind you so those guys can eat too, Whitlow says. Who made sure rent and utilities were paid? It was a dollar per square foot, <laughs> Clem says. The dairy was an informal community of like-spirited people. The building was their sanctuary, even with its idiosyncrasies. Clem and artist Eric Fix remember the intense cold and the rain drizzles that occurred on the third floor. Roof repairs were nearly constant. With medium income rent between $450 and $625 to encourage Jackson Ward's renaissance. Make art. Ready? Okay! Make art. Hey! All right! Hey! You need to be a mighty artist. Let's go! Artist Amy Allwood. Yes. Yeah, he loves that. <laughs> 